media coverage I'm not sure from whom um, AM News Talk 1010 is here talking to Chris um, I also have a scheduled interview with them later today now one of our group members told me that they've been listening to AM 1010 and they were straight out bashing me all day so I'm not confident as to how much uh, of a fair portrayal they're gonna give me today but uh, at the very least they're giving me an opportunity to to share my piece to share my point of view so I'm grateful for that uh, once again, AM 1010, I'm speaking to them today at 2.30. Um, I think that's them at 2.30. I have an interview at 2.30 and then another one at 3.30, so I forget which station is. Global News is also uh, going to be speaking to me later today. Anyway, we're here on the corner of Young and Dundas, everyone, and uh, we're giving out the, the uh, mask education flyers, letting people know about the dangers of wearing a mask. And uh, once again, this is part of the Hugs Over Mask initiative started by Vlad, and I'm very grateful that, uh, you know, that this movement is, it has been created to educate people about the dangers of wearing a mask and also about our constitutional rights to not be imposed upon. Wonderful, 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 Donald. Yeah, we're here taking a stand for our freedoms. We, we just, uh, a, a group of about 50 of us took a ride on the TTC without wearing our masks. He's saying that within 30 seconds of taking off the mask, you're going to feel better. Thank you guys. I appreciate it, Donald. Oh yeah, now he's talking about uh, social isolation and how it's, it's, it's a form of torture. That's right. That's right. Thank you, Vlad. Thanks for all your efforts, brother. Thank you. Thank Vlad you. is amazing. <laughs> My pleasure. So anyway, that's what we're doing right now. We're on the corner of Young and Young and Bloor and uh, giving out our our mask education flyers. We provide the real data. And don't provide fake models. Yeah, uh, all of you should know that you have a right to medical exemptions in this country, including with a new uh, bylaw that is coming into place in Toronto. Uh, you have a right to medical exemption. So w when you're going into a store, uh, I'm not sure what didn't help. Yeah. Yeah, Vlad is saying that the mortality rate from the flu shot is higher than the mortality rate for this virus. It's ridiculous. Anyway. No. Why on earth a child has to wear a mask? It's a child of you. Masks on children is a child abuse. Child abuse. By the government. Absolutely we horrendous. That. That's right. Children need our protection. That's right. Children need our support. Oh. We've been giving out flyers to passers by that wear masks. Why are you not talking about suicide cases? Why are you not talking about suicide cases? Let me see your let me see your poster, sister. Let me see your poster. I love it. Yeah. That's right. Those are called collateral deaths. This government is responsible for every single person dying of cancel surgeries. Delayed investigative procedures. And not allowed actual treatments with hydroxychloroquine. When the government is denied a common treatment, it's killing people. This government is responsible. Hashtag, who, who killed these people? This is what we're going to go. That's right. Hashtag, who killed these people? That's right. Anyway, we'll, uh, we'll check in a bit later, everyone. Thanks for watching. And uh, hugs over masks. Stay strong out there. Know your rights.
Beautiful. Thank you, my little brother. Bless you all. Take care.